Hey, what's up everybody? This is Jay, back with another comic book pickup video for the month of April, I guess. Yeah, it was for April. I should have been recording this video, but I've been BSing, so I will be probably recording another video for May in like, in like probably like two days. Today is the 19th, I think of the year, the 19th. But um, let's get to these comic books. Uh, the first one is uh, Planet Hawk World, World Breaker, which actually they crossed out Breaker and put Broken, and this is issue number five, which should be the final issue in this limited series. Next, we have Cosmic Ghost Rider, issue number two. Here's the first variant. And here's the main cover. So it's only one variant to issue number two and the main cover. Next, we have Rogue and Gambit. Issue number two, here's the variant. And I'm riding out of um, Guns of Blazing out of Las Vegas. Next one is the variant cover to it as well. And this was basically the last... Uh, the last pack of these covers, so I don't have these covers anymore. When I went to go order them, the um, the seller doesn't have them anymore. So I had to sw I switched to the um, the selling ones, and I do like to sell mine in the front instead of the back. But this is a uh, Hollow's Eve issue number two. This is the main cover. Uh, here's a variant, well, the only variant. This month, comics was kind of light, and they probably gonna be moving forward because I am gonna push to collect less comics and probably even video games. After The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom came out, that's probably one of the last games I'm probably gonna pre order. Anything else I get is gonna be stuff that I previously pre ordered. Uh, next is Red Goblin number three. Here's the main cover. Here's a variant, same man variant at that. Here's another, here's a variant cover. Next is the Amazing Spider Man 24, and here's the main cover. Here's a variant of 24. Next is Amazing Spider-Man number 23. Here's the main cover with the, with the Fantastic Four on the front. Here's another variant cover on top of the cell tower. Next is Spider-Gwen's Shadow Clones, issue number two. There's the main cover with all the different Spider-Gwen villains as Spider-Gwen, the clones. Another issue number two, this is the, this is the main cover, the variant edition. Next we have Spider-Man 2022, End of the Spider-Verse Part 7. That should be, if I remember correctly, the finale of the Spider-Verse saga within that comic. Here's another variant. I like the Mecha variant. Next, we have the I Am Iron Man or War Machine <laughs> variant cover to the limited Iron Man series. That's issue number two, and there should be three more issues, and then this is over with. Next is the main issue, main cover. I did jump on this new Warlock Rebirth um, comic for Adam Warlock. Here's issue number one. That's the main cover. Throw back to the uh, 90s and 80s co um, covers and labels. Here's issue number one again, the variant cover. Next is Silver Surfer Ghost Light number three. Here's the main cover. Well, the only cover because there's nothing else I have for this one. Uh, here's Sense of Sinister. Storm and the Brotherhood of Mutants, Brotherhood of Mutants, 
issue number three. There was only one cover to this one that I received. Then you have Night Sins of Sinister, Nightcrawlers. I like the cover. Don't know who that is. Who is that a blend of? But she is on all of them. A lot of covers. Well, all the covers so far, except for one. And that looks like that's a variant. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Next is uh, Immoral X-Men. I like this cover. Oh, this has something to do with Sinister. And has him messing up shit. Here's issue number three. Here's the main cover. And uh, Static Shock. Shout out to Dakota. Issue number three, Milestone, 30th Anniversary. This is another limited series that I collect as well. I've been loving the art with these Static Shock. Shout out to Dakota. Here's another cover. I don't collect many DC comics, but when I do, I try to get some of the ones that I really would know I'm going to read. Uh, here's uh, Batman and the Joker, The Daily Duo. This is book number six. I believe there's only one more left, and I already have it, but it's for the next next um, video. I'm going to go pick up some comics today, and that should be the stash for the month of May. All right, here's another cover for Batman and Joker. And here's the third and final cover for issue number six. I really like issue number seven covers better, though. Here is Darkwing Duck issue number four. That's one cover. Here's another cover. Here's the third cover. The fourth cover. And the fifth and final cover. Now I just gotta organize them later. I'll put them up in the boxes that I have for, for them. I separate them as a series and stuff. And I'm probably the only comic I'm probably gonna currently keep, more or less, is gonna be the Spider-Man 22, 2022 series. But I don't know how to decide because the rest of them are really limited series. So I might just stick to having two or three limited series at a time. Cause um after a while that stuff just I'm gonna be running out of space. I'm gonna have to get another I got a four I'm gonna dump the four boxes of comics. And um they they not they're not small boxes. So I'm gonna have to slow that down before I don't have nowhere to put them because uh, my game room is kinda jam not jam packed, but it's to the point where I don't like to have stuff on the floor and there's stuff on the floor, so I'm gonna have to slow down. It's uh these collecting the comics. My video games, I'm really only collecting new stuff if I do and stuff that I want and currently it's not a lot of stuff that I want that I see out there but when I do see it I do get it so I did grab a couple of games like all the Mario parties for the, Nintendo, um, for, the, for the GameCube I do currently have them now I gathered those maybe in the last month and a couple other games I did forget to return a damaged copy of Code of Lambs um, Premium Edition or whatever it's called Deluxe Edition so I do have two, so I may be doing a raffle or something for that. I haven't decided. I have been tied up playing uh, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom simultaneously trying to um, beat Breath of the Wild again. And I'm, I'm starting to get caught more into Breath of the Wild than I am Tears of the Kingdom. So I'll play them both. I, I have multiple switches, so I can just, I don't mean I don't have to stop each game just to play it. So, um... That's really my video for the rest of the, um, for this month. I did get a lot of um, nice little covers. So these are gonna be in the next month's video. I just wanna show y'all a little bit. Three that I, I actually posted as pictures on all my social media as well. And this is why I say I like the Joker covers for issue number seven better than number six. I just like them some just the, the art on them is crazy. 
and I, I like I said, I'm an art. I love art, especially comic art. It's just like they 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 was really ready for these. I hope hopefully it's the last issue because most Marvel series only go up to five for limited, and most of the DC series do too. So I, I like those. Those are part of the next month, which I don't know. Depending on what I got coming in now, it's probably gonna be the same size stack. But that's my video for the day. I will be doing a uh, video game video basically at the end of the month just to make sure I have nothing else coming in. I shouldn't have anything else. Well, I, I do have something coming in. I'm just waiting for it to ship. Uh, but um, I should be having Final Fantasy Pixel, um, the Pixel version from 1 through 7 or whatever number it is. And um, maybe some limited run games because, you know, they be playing games. A lot of stuff I'm still waiting on, like that Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game. But with with all that being said, that's the end of my video. Always follow me on all of my social medias. That's S A K two one one L. Like I said, I have a Facebook now, Instagram, TikTok, Twitch, um, YouTube, and Sack is normally my name on every. Um, game of platform except for I mean it is for Xbox but I really don't I don't have an Xbox a current Xbox to play with you on so if you want to play anything with me I do have a PS5 and a Switch and if you want my Switch code just let me know matter of fact I'll probably start putting my Switch code in my actual uh, my details on all my social media YouTube Instagram Twitch me uh, Twitch Switch, and all that also follow Anchor Gamers our website is under construction right now, so we're trying to um, get everything situated there so people can start ordering jerseys and more. And like I always said, the jerseys are nice. Um, my jerseys are, are in the upper room because I'm debating on should I, um, I might put them in, um, in um, frames. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. But um, that follow Anchor on all our social media. Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, um, Twitch. I'm trying to think. Of anything. Am I missing anything? I said YouTube, yeah, and Facebook. Just no TikTok. But most of the members we do have TikToks. So, like I said, if you want to follow me, you can. You want to follow the rest of Anchor Gamers. Almost everybody besides myself has AG or Anchor Gaming in their name. So you might like um, Maurice, Anchor Mo, Mo Ice, and a few other people. Um, but that's the end of my video. Y'all have a great day and y'all enjoy yourself.